Yo, what is good, yo? It's your boy Tot back here with another video, guys. In this video today, we are going to be doing Extreme Makeover My Team Edition, I think episode number 13, guys. If you are new to this channel and haven't yet, smash that subscribe button. And if you guys want to be eligible, to you know participate in a my team makeover make sure to stay tuned to my twitter every saturday or sunday as i put out a tweet all you guys got to do is reply with your team mt amount for a chance to be involved in these videos guys without further ado let's hop right into the video this far, first squad here was set in by hugo on twitter and this is a pretty tough squad to really decide what to do with because i like his squad so far outside of lamella ball i truly like his squad um, but it's tough in the fact that he doesn't have a ton of MT. He has 400k MT, and the first piece you obviously need to pick up is, is Yao Ming. Um, there's a fly there, sorry. But Yao Ming, okay, that's the first guy you have to absolutely pick up, but that takes 350, so you got, you really got 50k left to work with. And ideally, you want to pick up Ben Simmons, but you don't have enough MT. And so the the thing I think you need to do, I hate to do this. I hate to do this, but I think you need to sell Kevin Durant. Pick up Ben Simmons. Pick up Kawhi Leonard. And this is the squad I would rock out with. I don't want to sell KD, but it's like, what is KD going for? I can check real quick and see. Kevin Durant right now is going for 500K. Um, so that would give you enough to get these two players, but... I don't, I don't see any other option really available uh, that you could possibly even do. I like Tim Duncan. I like Hakeem. Larry Bird's fine. Reddish is good. You know, you can keep Lamelo around if you want to plug in out of position. LeBron, you can do that as well. But this is the squad I would rock out with. This next squad here was set in by Braden on Twitter. Says he has 626k MT to work with, which is plenty. That's plenty with what we're going to need to do with the squad. So the first thing that glares out to me is your shooting guard position is perfectly fine. I'm not going to change anything there. Um, but I am going to say this. Yao or Eddie Curry or Hakeem, you get to keep one and you need to get rid of one. So for the sake of this video, I'm going to keep Eddie Curry there. Um, just because I like Eddie Curry uh, a little bit more than Hakeem right now because I'm more comfortable with him. Uh, Spicy P, I love you, but you got to go too. And I'm going to pick up... Uh, Galaxy Opal James Wiseman uh, to plug in here just because size is so so important and I love you know Wiseman at the four Eddie Dino that's a great combo as well um, we have spent a little bit of empty on that a lot of empty so you know we spent probably if you really I don't even know what Wiseman is going for let me look I'm gonna look what Wiseman is going for real quick just to kind of know how much empty I have to spend because I don't I don't want to spend you know over what I have to uh, what I have left to spend on um, on these players. So I really want to get uh, these prices right. I don't think he's going for a ton. Um, yeah, he's going for a buy now. So, you know, we spent, you know, probably 450K. But the thing about it is you still should have enough to move and groove. You got to get rid of TakeOver Giannis and get rid of Cam Reddish both. I hate to say it, but you absolutely do. Um, just for the MT standpoint, from an MT standpoint, actually, I'm going to keep Reddish in here. I like his value, uh, but Giannis, I think, needs to go. Um, and it's a tough one. It's definitely a, t a, a tough Actually, you know what? I'm going to keep Giannis. I know I'm being a little hesitant here. I like this Giannis for his price. I really, really do. But the tough thing is you're going to have to let one of these shooting guards go. You're going to have to if you want to build up your point guard position. So KD, T-Mac, it's your preference for the sake for the sake of this video, I dropped KD last time. KD, you can you can stay this time. Uh, I'm going to pick up Kawhi Leonard. You're getting a little bit of MT back. I'm not exactly sure uh, what Tracy goes for. I'm going to look really quick. Because there are all these new cards that I don't really know exactly what they go for. Uh, Tracy is going, you know, for 400K. So you're getting about, four, you know, 200 extra K there. Oscar, you're fine. Oscar, you're going to stay. But I'm going to pick up Benjamin Simmons to run the starting point guard position. Now, this might be pushing your budget a little bit. If it is, you know, you could keep Pasco Siakam instead of James Wiseman for a little bit longer. Uh, but I think you should have enough to build this squad right here. This next squad here was saying by Aaron Baines for MVP. Aaron Baines for MVP. I don't know on Twitter, but he's got a very good squad. He says he has 115k MT to work with, which is enough. So... The first thing I'm going to tell you to do is get rid of Steve Smith. I love Steve Smith a lot, but there is no denying Chris Middleton is undoubtedly better than Steve Smith. He is. I love Steve Smith, but Middleton is better for very, very cheap. Now, the next thing I'm going to tell you to do is move labor right here. Thad Young, I love you. 
Um, I love you. But I just, I can't imagine a time in which Thad Young is better than Goat Hakeem. Like, if, if you're telling me they go for about the same price, how are you going to take Thad Young over Hakeem? It's, you can't. You simply can't. Um, and that's really the only way I can phrase it. I love... Um, I, I love. I don't mind Thaddeus Young. It's just he doesn't really fit the mold of what you need. This squad right here is absolutely comp level. And this is the squad I would rock out with. This next squad was sent by my boy Mower on Twitter. Says he has about two, or he said he has 500k MT to work with. So it's a lot of MT to work with. But you got some. You got. You got some places to fill here. Okay, you do. And I'm gonna start out by selling just a few players. So if I was you, I would sell these players here. I would sell Zion. I would definitely sell Bill, and I, I'm just gonna remove Steve Smith because you don't need him. Okay, so then you can move Dino there, Eddie there for the time being, uh, and you got a little bit more MT to work with. Now the first thing I'm gonna do, get rid of Russ. I know you might like Russ, but try this Ben Simmons. Ben Simmons is incredible, and he can help you do some great things. So that's about 200, 250, probably 250k, so about half your MT. Uh, Steph, you know you're okay, but you gotta go in this certain situation, guys. And really, it's your preference. You could pick up LaMelo, you could pick up LeBron, or you could pick up an Evo Jalen Rose. For the sake of this video, let's pick up an Evo, Evo Jalen Rose. Uh, and then also get, um, let's see here, let's see. Let's think about what would be good here. Let's get a Kawhi Leonard. I think he will be great here. I, I get your size isn't that great, but if you want to balance things out a little bit more, you can swap these two. Uh, I don't mind MJ at all. I think you can definitely run him. And this is the squad I would rock out with. This next squad here was sent in by my boy, bruh, on Twitter. And he has a very, very, very good squad. Uh, he does have 300k, but his squad is missing one key piece. Okay? So let's say this is the 11-man rotation, which is absolutely fine. Do you got, Can you guys see what I see? I know what he's missing, guys. I'm sorry, Tracy. But for the sake of this, you've got to go. Because I need to see Yao Ming on this squad. I need to see Yao. Uh, if you don't have this locked in, you could sell. Whichever. I don't know if you got Davis locked in or Wiseman. Sell one of them. Whichever one you don't like more. <clears throat> Let's say for the sake of this video, it's him. Uh, plug Dino in there. Get rid of Eddie Curry. And then get Yao Ming moving and grooving there at the center position. Then you're still going to have a little bit of MT left over. I don't think you're going to have a ton, but just a little bit. In which you can do whatever you want with it. Truly, you can move Kawhi here if you want to uh, and pick up kind of a budget shooting guard and maybe like a Chris Middleton. Um, kind of struggling to think of, of a lot of other shooting guards. You can run Spicy P here at the small four position. And honestly, that's, uh, I don't know, it's tough because of how many GOAT cards we have. It's kind of tough to tell you to, to run, you know, a Spicy P type card. Um, it really is. There's just so many good cards that we have in today's game. And that's the tough part about it. You know, I don't know. I'm going to look here and see what this this other Giannis is going for. Yeah, small forward Giannis is still going for way too much. So it's just, it's tough. Because you can even pick up a Tim Duncan at power forward. But the small forward position is still one of the weaker positions in the game. Uh, the primary small forward is not. But, but uh, you know, I want to play Kawhi at the shooting guard. So I'm going to plug in Pascal Siakam to complete this squad. This next squad here was set in my by my boy Khalid on Twitter, and this is going to be kind of the same thing. Like, I get you have 100k, but I don't see Yao Ming, and I'm sorry, but Yao Ming is by far the best card in the game, and he's going for like 400k MT. So you got to find a way to get him. It all starts with selling T Mac. You can move Cam there, do whatever you got to do. Sell Eddie Curry. I don't really care. I don't really care. Sell Eddie Curry. Find a way to get Yao in the lineup, and then you can move and group. Then you can move some guys around. Um, you know, if you like Lamelo, you can keep him. Obviously, I'm gonna pick up a Kawhi Leonard type card. Uh, and if you if you like Jimmy, you can move Jimmy here. If you like um, Chris Middleton more, who I would actually prefer, that's who I'm gonna plug in right here. And I get your lineup's not that tall right now um, uh, with this with the shooting guard and small forwards, but. Listen, you're running Katie and Jonathan Isaac at the point guard positions. I don't think you should be too worried about that. Quite honestly, if you wanted to, um, what I would maybe consider is if you have enough MT sliding KD here and picking up a Galaxy up with uh, Ben Simmons. That's if you have enough MT. That's going to be a little bit much. But this should be your goal for your end game squad. This next squad was saying by my boy Hunter on Twitter. He did say he had around 100K to work with. And so with 100K... 
It's a little bit empty, and it all starts with just upgrading a few positions. This Eddie Curry upgrade is going to cost about 10k. You know, I'm going to plug Dino in here somewhere, and I don't know whether to um, plug him at the power fort or center. I'm going to do this. I'm going to plug in Jeff Green here, um, and then plug in uh, Dino right here. So we're going to go with a little smaller lineup, um, kind of what I have to do with what I'm given right now. Uh, Cam Reddish, you're going to stay because uh, really you have to stay for me i don't really i don't really have a choice um with that i really don't have a choice uh the only other thing i can really do with this lineup uh plug in michael jordan pink diamond here um i do think that'll help you out um uh and then the last thing i'm gonna do is replace nicholas batum with thaddeus young i mean other than these simple changes there's not a whole lot i can do with the team but i do think with 100k I made this team look a ton better. The last squad today was sent in by JM. He says he has about a million MT to work with and he wants me to build the squad. So I can do that. First guy I'm going to add to the squad is Pao Ming. Yao Ming. Then LeBron Odom. Keep one, sell one. For the sake of this video, I'm going to sell. Actually, get rid of them both. Pick up pick up Jalen Rose. You know, for the MT standpoint, pick up Evo Jalen Rose. And then pick up ben simmons and then i'm gonna get rid of this Kawhi, add the the better Kawhi uh to the squad just because i think he is just that little bit better move larry bird to the three move kareem there yow there so now you know we got we, we're starting to work with a squad here so now i'm gonna pick up dino and then i'm also going to pick up uh james wiseman um here now if you want to pick up eddie curry you can definitely do that as well uh, but you're starting to see the squad come together you truly are uh, you still got quite a bit of MT. So you're going to spend up in the MT category on one of these positions and probably save in the other position. So for the sake, I don't see why we can't go out and get a GOAT Kevin Durant and then just save here. You know what? Yeah, I like you a lot, Chris Middleton. So we're going to plug you in right there. You could go Cam Reddish if that's who you prefer, but I absolutely love this Chris Middleton card. And honestly, if I was you, this is the squad I would rock out with. Now with that last squad, I might have went, you know, 100, 2,000 over, but hey. You don't know how the market's going to end up. The market could be high now, end up way worse, or way, you know, down a little bit in two hours from now, which you'll easily have enough. It just depends. I think you should have about that amount to spend, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy the video today. It's getting hard, my team makeover, with the cards we have. I got to check prices constantly because the market was just down yesterday. Now it's back up. Who knows what the market's going to continue to be like. But I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love y'all. And have a blessed day.